Hey, everybody, it's Picks and Deep on Sportsnet.ca, the show that gets everything right but uh, makes no guarantees. I'm J.D. Bunkus. He's Justin Bourne. We're red hot. We picked the Montreal series game seven with Toronto perfectly under check. Both of us Montreal plus 200 as underdogs check. Both of us. Let's try and keep this thing rolling. Let's stay hot. Let's preview the Winnipeg Jets and the Montreal Canadiens. I like the Jets. I, I just think minus 127 as a series price is a pretty fair number for a team that has what I think Toronto didn't, which is the ability to get secondary scoring down the lineup against the Canadians and not just let Phil Deneau and their best four defensemen focus in on one line. I also like where the Jets' power play is at far more than where I like Toronto. So I I don't mean to disrespect Montreal, but I wasn't blown away by them in that last series in a way that's going to make me believe that they're just going to be able to roll what they did against Toronto and against what I think is actually sneakily all of a sudden a better Winnipeg team. How, How do you feel about it? Yeah, I'm just like super fixated on the Vegas result in game one against Colorado. Colorado sitting at home waiting for an opponent. Vegas plays a game seven, finds their way through and plays two days later. They looked atrocious. I mean, Montreal is doing that now. They're playing in Winnipeg two days after that game. Jets are rested. I feel like that's going to spot Winnipeg game one. And anytime you got a close series like this, thinking that, you know, that there's that much of a a bent in game one, I I feel like that gives the Jets a leg up. So I am going with the Jets as well. I'm actually really hoping that Montreal carries the momentum through, through game one, gets a W, and then I can double down on my Winnipeg bet because I just, I see it over a course of a long series, I'm getting it done. So the way that this series plays out, this is where the fun part gets, where we get to do more player props. And I know that you love a bunch in this series. So let's start with you. What's your favorite player prop? Uh, I got Jeff Petrie. So Jeff Petrie's line is set at three points. Um, This is a guy who can get three points in a game. You know, if their power play is halfway decent, he looked really good at the end of the Leaf series. Like he was kind of coming on a bit and it pays plus 140. So I also, you know, I love to hit right on that number for a push uh, and it is 3.0. So I like that one. And then Caulfield last series, his goal line was for two even goals. It's 1.5. It's gone down. And I thought he showed some promise in that series too. rung a couple off yeah. the iron. Uh, he plays uh, pays plus 150 for over one and a half goals. I've got the over on Caulfield. Yeah. I like bets where you try and basically play the larger sample and know that someone's been cold like Petrie. I also yeah. thought Caulfield was dangerous. My player prop for this series is Nikolai Ehlers over two and a half goals pays plus 140 which I think is pretty insane value considering that William Nylander just dominated the Montreal Canadiens. And I kind of look at Ehlers as a very, very similar version to that when he's going his very best. Ehlers scored two goals in his first game back in the last series. And I know that's against Edmonton and it's not the same team defensively. It's not Carey Price, but that's the kind of player he is where you can see volume in one game. And so I I feel like with his power play responsibilities and the fact that it's going to be way better than Toronto's, his ability to get on the score sheet hit the way that he's played all season long. And the fact that he's been able to rest now and kind of get back to himself. I think that's a crazy number for Nikolai Ehlers. I love him to go over two and a half. And along with that, his boy, Kyle Connor, his line is three goals yeah. uh, in the series, which, you know, yeah. four seems like a lot of, lot to win it three to get the, at least the push I feel is pretty safe. It's it pays yep. plus one, uh, 125 and he killed Montreal this year. So I like that one too. Yeah. So I like the Jets in the series. I think you, you do as well. We like some overs and point totals and goal totals, but yes, I am going to be betting unders in this series if they keep setting the line at five and a half regulation goals because I need these groups to prove it to me. I need these goaltenders to look human. I need Montreal to prove that they can actually score. (laughs) So we'll see. Uh, Tune in, subscribe, follow, keep checking us out. We'll be trying to produce these videos before every game throughout the playoffs. This is Fixin' Deep, sportsnet.ca. Thanks for watching.